lifetime. And just like the mumps and German measles, this too shall be remembered as one of those somethings. So without further ado, or ado from any distance, we bring you Rocky and Bullwinkles. You call this a marathon marathon. <laughs> You're watching Rocky and Bullwinkle. You call this a marathon marathon on Cartoon Network. Okay, we go to commercial. Then we come back from commercial. How do you know we come back from commercial, darling? Should they forget passport? Oh, boy. Okay, Mr. President, here's some bills to sign. We've got President Scooby's Movies for the People. Uh huh. Scooby Movies for All. Yes, sir, we. Tonight, President Scooby is screening his foreign policy film, Scooby Doo on Zombie Island. And we'll also take a look at animal rights with Scooby Doo and the Reluctant Werewolf. It's President Scooby's Movies for the People. Tonight, starting at 7 on Cartoon Network. <laughs> Rocky and Bullwinkles, you call this a marathon? Marathon. Followed by President Scooby's Movies for the People on... Oh, by the way, tell the engineer to oil those engines. Terrible racket. We'll return to our marathon after these commercial messages. I sure hope they're not mixed. The commercial? No, the messages. Did you see this banner? Did you write down the name Frostbite Fall? Then enter the ultimate road trip sweepstakes, where you could win a road trip. I got a pocket full of dimes. Oh, this darling, do we have to come back from commercial? Why do you wear? I have nothing to wear. <laughs> then maybe we make the gravy. <laughs> You've just watched the three-hour marathon of Rocky and Bullwinkle. We suggest a warm back cabinet with saltines while avoiding heavy machinery or blind dates. Heavy or otherwise. 